different things took place. I was sitting at my desk at 4 o'clock, got a call from his wife and said Destry had gone out, fight fire, got caught in that situation. 60% of his body was burned. They're care flighting him uh, to Oklahoma City. Lived the next 21 days, uh, then passed away. That changed my life. Changed my life in many ways, but changed my life personally the way the way I would love people and allow people to love me, my relationships, every, it, it changed my relationship with my wife in, in a bad way initially. It, it caused me to really push people away and to question things of God, just, just a lot of things. He left behind two baby little, two little beautiful girls. Uh, many of you know little Mackenzie. We've been praying for her that has cancer. Uh, God's healed her from cancer. She's home doing great now. But so a lot of things took place. And so right then I was in full-time ministry, Youth pastor and loved God. God had been, I mean, had, everything was going great, but that affected me in a way that I started to take what I walked through in that and the hurt and disappointment, and I started to apply that to every relationship that I had. And I noticed that every good friend that I had and every person that was close to me, I began to push them further and further away. They'd reach out. The more they reach out to me, the more I didn't want to talk to them, the more I didn't want to be around them. And it was five years ago 